Hi, this is Gary Butterfield of the Watch Out for Fireballs podcast, here with another Let's Play. Uh, this is all very new and novel to me, so I'm doing a bunch of them. Um, again, thanks to Nick Glauber for help setting me this up for me. Uh, this is Bad Street Brawler. This is the game that I challenge Cole to. Um, another game that I have some experience with is a youth. Um, there's a story I want to tell about it. It's not much of a story, but uh, I'm going to tell it during the episode, so you should check that out. But I figured I'd give everyone just kind of a first glance if you want to check out what this game is about. Uh, that Cole will be, will be put through this ringer uh, because I'm a bad person. Um, where is the source of light on this, uh, <laughs> on this uh, first drawing here? And look at those clavicles. Anywho, uh, let's start with uh, Duke Nukem's uh, post-leukemia self here. Let's go. So one player start. And this is a game that was originally for the Power Glove. Um, never trouble trouble till trouble troubles you is the uh, words of wisdom I have here. So this is the a game that was made for the Power Glove. Um, but I didn't know that. As a young boy, uh, I had this game, played it like I was just a, oh my god, just a normal guy. <laughs> um, holy shit. Um, I don't know how this would even work with the Power Glove. So you don't, uh, jump is up, never and I, never okay, um, and then, so, A is this kick thing I got going on here, and then B is my, my punch, um, I hate these little guys, that's the point of my character. Alright, I'm up. That's actually awesome though, everything that guy just did. I thought there was going to be a little storyline boss fight where I killed him one hit and he came back and grabbed uh, like an older brother or something. So both buttons does this. I don't know what that does though. Um, these graphics are really bad. Look at my guy's face. There's so little definition to him. Oh. Yeah. Thank you. Spy vs. Spy, or Boris from uh, Moose and Squirrel. Uh, Rocky and Bowwinkle, there we go. Um, yeah, it's a weird street brawl I'm having here. I'm sorry, I'm not actually talking very much about the game. Oh shit, I have a time limit down at the bottom. 15 seconds? Ah, oh, bad street brawler. This guy looks like, and here's something that nobody who's listening to this will know I'm talking about. Um, in the 90s, there was a Toxic Avengers cartoon. Because nothing, you know, nothing appeals to kids more than, like, a atrociously uh, hard-to-watch trauma movie. And uh, he had these little buddies. So there was a Toxic Avenger. Oh, I think I could have practiced during that last part, but I wasn't uh, doing it. I'll do that next time. So Toxic Avenger had some buddies with him. Um, I watched the cartoon a couple times. I loved the toys for some reason. And they were gross. It was like... Um, Mutagen Man, you know, from the Turtles, like that was always cool. Uh, Muck, those characters. So this guy who comes up and stabs me at the end of this level, um, and I'm assuming he's, he's faded too. It's like the, the house that's going to burn down in Sinodoki, New York. Um, he looks just like Toxic Avenger had a buddy who was a guy with a big nose. Um, he put snot into his back, which would fire out of his nose in the front. Um, so... How would you play this with a power glove? I don't see, and the time limit is really just encouraging me to avoid these guys and make my way to this, this boss battle. Oh, you're the boss? There we go. I thought, I thought I picked up a bat. Um, oh, look at how your look at the posture of your arms when you run. <laughs> look how big you how much what? <laughs> oh, Cole, this game is actually awesome. Why why did I think this was a bad game challenge for you? This game is fucking rad. What am I doing? Um, look how much mass you gain when you duck down. If there's not like another boss after this, I actually yes. This game is actually awesome, and I... <laughs> Alright. 
Oh, hey. I got new weapons now. Yes. Yes. All of this. Okay. <laughs> let's <laughs> let's do it. I got I got to do that trip on people. Oh my god. I tripped him and he just turned into a bat right away. I <laughs> Oh. This is bringing back a lot of memories. How did I forget this? This isn't the kind of thing you forget. Like this is I should have had to Ah. Can I can I uh pull down his pants? No, I just collapse him into a a dead monkey. Alright. No need to fight these uh toxic avengers. What are they scared of? Oh. Ah. I, I'm not bringing very much commentary to this because I'm really kind of flabbergasted by it. Oh, shit. This is the big guy from uh, Rocky and Bowwinkle. So, yeah, this game is actually awesome. Uh, since I, I don't have very much to say about it, and since it's Cole, Cole's game, I wasn't intending on playing it this long, but I'm just, I'm, I can't tear myself away. I want to know what's next, even though apparently it looks like we're fighting the same. So, I guess I'm cleaning up the streets in some way, and the way I'm doing it is to kill all the monkeys, circus minute, midgets, and blue baseball bat guys, and then throwing their weapons into the trash. So I guess, you know, cleaning up the streets. Um, okay, what do we got here? Ooh, a stooge hit? A drop kick? Um, this game rules. I... Oh, look at that color. It's so ugly. It's it's like anticipating the brown singularity of the, the 2000s. That's my favorite move right there. But no time for you. I have bosses to fight, buddy. I guess I could be amassing a higher score by uh, actually fighting these, these fools. Um, I have no interest in that, though. I need to get a set of clothing that matches my hair. Oh. Um, I assume that matches my his hair. I am colorblind, so it's... Okay, so that goes as long as I hold the buttons here. Ah. No! No! through city center. I think this is going to be my move for this time. Nice little attention to graphics there when he hits his hand and the sparks pop out. Even when I'm just like practicing, just running and hitting the air. Well, that, I guess that damages people. I guess I have an enemy life meter down on the bottom. Yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you, Spy vs. Spy. There's dogs, too. Yeah. What would be the weapons of the dog world? I wonder what they should be dropping. Alright. Ah. No, no! Son of a bitch. That guy is the hardest enemy in the game, by far. Alright. So, okay, Bad Street Brawler. Cool. We'll enjoy you. I'm looking forward to talking to you. Um, we will, uh, so again, two weeks, anniversary episode, hear us talk about, uh, the game that He-Man, Ken, Scotty, Scotty, and Bimar has all loved, Bad Street Brawler. Thanks for checking out these Let's Plays. Leave comments, subscribe on the YouTube if you like them, and, uh, always remember to watch out for fireballs.